Hello there, grade 2. For today, I'm going to teach you how to measure a line and how to draw a line with a specific measurement using the unit of centimeters. Okay, so usually in a ruler, we have two types of uh, units used, actually tatlo, because uh, there are times that uh, a ruler uses uh, uses millimeters rather than centimeters. So I ha I hope that you'll be able to find a ruler in your house that that uh, uses the unit of uh, centimeters. Okay, so that it will be easier for you. Okay, so anyway, uh, dalawang units natin, no? One is inches, which is the one that's above, yung medyo malalaki kaunte compared to the one that are uh, below. Uh, which is uh, centimeters. This is centimeters. Okay. This one ang inches sa taas. So anyway, for today, we are going to make use of centimeters. Sa baba. Okay. When we measure, we always start at zero. The first mark. Not here. Okay, not here. But at this point. Okay. Because if you're going to start at the edge of the ruler, that will give you a slight um, difference in terms of measurement. Okay, so when we measure, we always start at this point, the first mark rather than the edge of the ruler, unless your ruler starts at the uh, at zero centimeters. Kasi may mga rulers na ganun. Uh, for example, kanino ba yung ruler na naalala ko that... Uh, Metal yun siya eh. I think it's Michael Gunn's ruler. So, yung edge ng ruler niya starts here. Talaga, sa, sa 0 cm. So, in that case, okay lang yun. Pero most rulers kasi, hindi. So, kindly look for the first mark. This represents the 0. Some rulers will indicate that it's 0. Some don't. Like in this case, wala. Anyway, ini print out ko lang yan kasi I can't find my ruler ngayon pa talaga. Uh, it was just here pag hindi mo na kailangan nandiyan lang pag kailangan mo na. It's quite hard for us to find it. Okay. So first things first is to measure. Okay. Kasi after measuring, I'm going to teach you how to draw. Okay. So for example, meron akong ni drawing na dalawang line dito. So if you in in your case sa sa camera view, it's it's slightly crooked kasi wide angle yung lens na ginagamit ko so nagiging iba siya so at some point nagiging curve siya di ba so anyway just for you to get the point of it so we have two lines for us to know uh, anong measurement ng kada isa so let's start with this line over here first line how to measure always again just like when we draw a line we always start at zero not here please do not start there okay Again, do not start at the edge of the ruler, but then again, start here. Yung sa first line talaga. Okay? You should start sa first line talaga. Yan, uh, there. Kunwari, ganito ngayon. Yan. Exactly there. So, if you see, it started here at zero and ends at, at some point here, which is sa... Uh, Five. So, we can say that this line measures 5 centimeters. I'm writing upside down. So, I hope I'm writing it the correct way. So, that's how you measure, okay? So, try natin again. In this case, we have another line. Again, when we measure, ito talagang first things first, ha? Please look at the first unit, which is 0. Diyan tayo mag-start mag-measure always. 0, then... You ha all you have to do now is to check where the line ends. It ends here. So if you can see, it ends at 8. So that's 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 8 siya nag-end. Ibig sabihin that this measures 8 centimeters. Okay? So ganun lang po tayo mag-measure. That's how easy it is for you to measure a line. Okay. Ngayon naman, how to draw a line? Kunwari, you are tasked to draw, let's say, draw a line that's 4 centimeters. Then again, I'm writing upside down. 
<laughs> right? Uh, draw 4 centimeters. First things first, make use of the tip of your pencil. Align nyo lang yan dyan somewhere. Ano yung point ng pencil ngayon? Tip ng point ng pencil is to mark where you should start, which is 0. Always 0. And since it's 4, look for 4. 4 is here. So, ito yung unit ng 4. Put a small mark there again. Slight lang, malit lang. Just for you to see. Then, you can now start drawing a line until it reaches that point. Then, from there, in my case, I need to darken it pala ngayon kasi hindi klaro sa camera pag hindi ko dinadarken. Okay. There. So, that's how you draw uh, a line. Okay, start at zero and look for that certain specific measurement and then draw the two dots and then combine the dots. Ganun lang kasimple. Okay, let's try another one. Dito ko sa taas isusulat ha. Let's say, ano ba? Hmm. Let's say 10 centimeters. Okay, so this is 10 centimeters. Again, you can start here, start here. Kayo na bahala as long as kasha pa sa papel. As long as the unit of 10 is included within the reach of the paper. Kapag ganito, hindi na pwede. See? Start here, the zero is already out. So, hindi na pwede. So, again, going back, we can start anywhere some, uh, along this area. So, kayo na bahala. So, in this case, I'm going to start here. Mark the zero and mark what is being asked, which is in this case, is 10. Then all you have to do now is you need to actually hold your ruler properly, ganito, as much as possible, at least two, uh, two fingers ang ginagamit ninyo to hold the ruler. Kasi kung isa lang, I'll show you why later. Okay, wait. I'll just draw the line. Just for you to see. So, that's how you draw a line. Okay. Bakit ko sinasabi sa inyo that you need at least two fingers to hold the ruler tight? Kasi if magdodraw kayo ng ruler, hindi siya gagalaw. See? Magdodraw kayo ng line rather, hindi magdodraw ng ruler. But if you're only going to make use of one and you're going to point, for example, from zero to let's say twelve. Tapos, pag draw nyo ngayon, ang mangyayari dyan, see? That's what happens if you only use one. Wala na. Look at what happened to my line. So, it's important for you to make use of two, at least two, to hold it in place. Okay? So that's basically it. That's how you you uh, you measure a line and draw a line using the unit of centimeters. Okay. So basically, making use of other units the same lang as long as you know how to read the units. Okay. So sa inyo basic pa lang so we won't get make use of etong mga smaller units na to. Actually, it's very easy. I know you can do it, but I'm so far from you. So digital lang tayo. So I cannot. Technically, I can. I can. Pero most of you will be asking questions kasi and baka mahirapan tayo in understanding compared to if we are close to one another. Okay. So anyway, yun na. This is the basic. Introduction lang yan. Maybe I can introduce you how to make use of that soon. Okay? So that's basically it for this session.